In the demanding year-round cycle of racing and simultaneous development, Toyota's off-road truck team faced a double challenge in 1986. After three consecutive years of capturing the country's premier stadium truck title, Cal Wells and his precision preparation crew set their sights on a fourth Manufacturer's Cup Challenge Championship, improving their trucks with newly designed automatic transmissions and designing a whole new concept in off-road suspension technology that will debut in 1987. This particular Toyota truck we're using right now, it's in its third season. It's possibly the last time we'll be running this truck because the new truck's nearly off the jig. And the new truck, I think, is gonna be a really super piece of machinery. In the dust-choked, bone-crunching arenas of off-road truck competition, the Toyota trucks and drivers once again lived up to their near legendary reputations. Drivers Ivan Ironman Stewart and Frank Arciero Jr. pushed the veteran trucks hard in the desert with Stewart claiming two unbelievable first place finishes in the unlimited class of the great Mojave 250 and the Baja 500. Often his competition including Porsche powered buggies that were thousands of pounds lighter with almost twice the horsepower. Toyota Steve Millen had no trouble grinding the competition in one Mickey Thompson off-road championship Grand Prix Stadium event after another placing first in Indianapolis, Detroit, and Houston, earning point after point toward what was already starting to look like a fourth Manufacturer's Cup championship in a row for the veteran but still tough Toyota truck. It has been successful, hasn't it? You know, to, to be running a truck uh, for three years and still winning most of the races is um, probably quite unheard of. Maybe so, but winning races is what happens when you combine talented drivers like Millen and Stewart with built tough Toyota trucks. Midway through the season, the Ironman rammed the truck through sand, rocks, and cactus to run away first place victories in the great Mojave 250 and the perilous but prestigious Baja 500. I, really do. I don't think there's anybody here, any driver that has any more fun or enjoys the work more than I do. And keep working. Steve Millen driving the same Toyota truck for the fourth year in a row, winning a heat or main event at each track clinched the Grand National Sport Truck Drivers Championship before the green flag fell on the last race. Ivan Ironman Stewart, steady finisher throughout the eight race series, wrapped up second place for a 1-2 Toyota Drivers Points finish, enabling Team Toyota to capture its fourth consecutive Manufacturers Cup Challenge Championship.